Hello and welcome back to my Craft the World Let's Play series. We are picking up from where we left off in the last episode because this thing is attacking us. Let's go to equip and you can see we can put some helmets on these guys. Let us make some. If we go in here, uh, advanced item working book, what's that? Technology book this research, this research will help you progress through a chosen technology more quickly. Oh. How do you get ink? <laughs> How do you get ink? Uh, let me see, where is ink? Anyways, we need the helmet. So, wooden helmet. We could make the wooden armor, but we don't have rope. So, to make rope we need wool, and we don't have any sheep here. And we can't make that until... Well, this guy's gone, because otherwise he will break through. Probably at that time. I still don't know. Used to immediately direct the nearest wolves to the specific spot. This didn't show up before in the last episode, but that's a very cool spell. I'll give you that. Anyways, we can make the wooden helmets. Let's make three, because we have three dwarfs. We have weapons and everything. All right, let us go to equip. Double click on that. Gond, Gond one, Gond two, and Bulko. All right, cool. Now they are at least a little bit more protected. Um, Why is this changed? There we go. Noise. Um, okay, to be honest, attack that guy. Go, 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 go. Come on, attack. Attacker. Actually, I'm going to put a portal there just in case. I don't know how strong this guy is, but hopefully we should be able to beat him. Yep, because he's only focused on that block. Okay. This is going to be easier than I thought. Okay, oh, we leveled up from that. Okay, we got an extra dwarf. Nice, nice, nice. To be honest, I really want a door there, but that's not my main priority for this episode. Uh, compilation of handcraft tricks. What is all this? Each level increases the speed of production at workbenches. Advanced woodworking book. Technology book. This research will help you progress through the chosen technology more quickly. This is cool. Lot. Ah. Abuse of food. Okay, interesting. Um, research library. Oh dear, there's a lot here that I have not seen in Craft the World before. Okay, let's see. What is the plan for today? First off, we need an extra wooden club for this guy. Oh, we made two. Okay, whatever. We need some more stone. There's a bunch of stone here, so I think we will have to take two trips. One here to get a bunch of stone. All right, let's get the stone here because we will need it for multiple recipes. So we might as well get it. Now we're here. They should be able to do this fairly quickly. And we should already be able to make some... Nope, they have not gone back with it yet. Okay, cool. I want this stone mined and I want this um, this wood gone. And I we need that sheep actually, to be perfectly honest with you. Now we should be able to make some more stone tools. So that, equip... And there you go, buddy. You can now do stuff more efficiently. Let us open another portal to here. Like so. And they will also... Nope. They will... No, okay. Well, that closes us up anyway. Anyway, let's take a look at the tech tree, because we do want to advance. Advanced ironworking. So that is one that we really need going, as well as advanced woodworking. But we need iron for that. So I think, first of all, let us get some torches going. Let us make... We're gonna need a lot, so let's make like, I don't know, 60? Yeah, that was all our wood. Um, yeah, and we need some background here as well, new creature. Ice spore, a little dangerous. These dangerous creatures are a source of meat as well as skin, which can be used to make items and armor. And we still need to be careful of these guys. We will assault those guys once we are ready for it. Um, I want wooden background here, but we need, of course, more wood to do that. Yeah, we need to get to this coal, you see. I want this coal mined. Also, I want to see what's over here. A lot of coal. Okay, so we got a coal deposit here, and we're go getting down to the uh, sand here. Oh, what's this? Yes, one of the abandoned mines. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. Okay, so. This is something new that we have discovered. This, I believe, yes, this is one of the new DLC abandoned mines. We got a bunch of rats down here, and we also got these beholders. 
these guys. Ah, again. Come on, guys. Attack. <laughs> these guys can be pretty tough. So we are not ready to go down here yet. But I assume there's a lot of iron in these places. But there's iron here, though. Plus, that's a hatch. Um... Hmm. Oh. Okay. Well, nice. Will this guy be able to take this thing on? Also, we can make rope now. That's good. We need beds. We need a home for these. We need everything. Okay. Hold everything. Hold everything. Need to craft some stuff. Okay, let's start with making some rope. And let us make... Uh, now we need leaves. Okay. Calm down. Uh, we need... We need, we need, we need, we need bits. Where is the bits? Bit, 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 bit. Bit of leaves. Okay, get the leaves. People, come on. Get the leaves. We need a temporary house here. Because otherwise these guys will not be happy. We have a totem here. I like to put my house underground. So we might very well use this space here. All the way over. But uh, we'll get to that eventually. Just... Uh, unable to put a totem... Well, we need the totem somewhere, so put it there. This is all just temporary. That's enough for two. We can put these guys down. We will be able to build a build leaves here. I don't think we might not be able to do it on the on the floor like that. Okay, I manually took over to the dwarf to get some work done. I want that thing killed. These guys are just still sleeping on the ground. I'm still waiting for more wood. We're not in the best of situations right now. I will admit this, because things could definitely be better. Control, put that thing there. Now use the beds. Come on, people. We need, let me see, five of these in total. We need some more wood. Okay, there we go. Now they're sleeping on that. Comfort average, 36%. Not great. Not perfect. But it will have to do for now. Things are not looking too good for us. I will admit this. Stop standing around. There's stuff to do. <laughs> uh, uh, these guys can drive you insane. Nope, you will not get down there. You will not get down here. Good. Nope. Uh. Why is he going that way now? Why? Attack people! <laughs> These dwarves are gonna be the end of this colony. <laughs> uh. Hold on. This last... Oh! Oh, we got a guy that doesn't even have stuff yet. Okay. Uh, Sirak. Okay, let us craft him some stuff. I don't want to lose dwarves. Okay. Hold on. Get that, get that. And get rid of that thing. Level 6. We got another dwarf. Guess I can go in and make this stuff again. Club. Need club. And we need more stone again. Let's see, should come through the portal anytime. There we go. Who is this guy? Drong. There you go, Drong. Get resources. Use the portal, guys. There we go. Oh no. Normal time. And Nain. There we go. Attacker. The normal skeletons shouldn't be that bad. They are pretty easy. But the guy with the shield is also pretty easy, apparently. Okay, that was fairly done. Okay, cool. Next. Actually, dig all this out. I want to dig this out, because we can make this even... I guess we can make this as the bed living room thing. I think we're gonna do that. So we're expanding the base a little here. And I think I will eventually want to break um, this up here and replace it with stone. Okay, and I want this broken as well. Now that we're at it and we're mining like crazy, might as well go all the way over here. Ooh, a coin. And I think eventually we will have a big roof going on top because when it snows, all the snow just stays there and it's really annoying. So I think a roof will eventually be a really good thing to have. I really want to get down here. Mm. Let's break that. 
and then break that. And then break these. And then go straight for this iron here, because we really, really need it. And eventually we will have like a pillar and a huge roof. All the way over to Grant's shop, I think. And then, yeah, do that. Oh, there's iron right here. Oh. That is very, very close, actually. Okay, that is... Oh. Yeah, <laughs> that's actually really close. Um, that's exciting. All right, guys, I have returned after quite a bit of work. I've done a lot of work here just to finish this episode, so we could actually have some uh, something new <laughs> here. Um, anyways, this is what I've done. I have cleared out this entire area and replaced it with wooden walls here, and we have the stone bordering the rooms, of course. Um, up here, I think I will replace this with stone as well, as that will kind of be our floor, I guess. We will have a door here, I think. Either a door here, or we will finish it all the way over here so we have this extra space, and then we will just have this hatch as our door or something. I don't know yet. Um, this door will be replaced with stone as well, and as I said, we will probably make like some pillars and then a huge roof all the snow to just fall on because this is just annoying like getting this because we can't yeah it's annoying um we found this iron deposit down here which we will probably aim for in the next episode i also removed all the bits because i intend for them to go down here instead because if we put them up here if we put them up here then we will have to basically more room and blah 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 but once we actually start getting the workbenches in um, they should be up here, if possible, because once they're done, they just throw this, or well, at least they used to, I don't know if they still does it, they would throw their stuff on the ground and they would have to come to the stockpile, which is over here. So it would only make sense that it's on the same level, the same floor, so the more towards we get, the more we can expand downwards and over. I will expand over here as well, and we will get this iron too. We do actually already have, um some iron somewhere let me see yes we have like seven iron ore because of the um place down here which is pretty good what is this i, I don't know what that meant anyways that's gonna do it for this one as you can see we have three minutes till the next monster wave which is going to be pretty exciting um we got a new dwarf by the way as well belagond he needs some new stuff as well i need to give him an axe this guy also needs an axe we don't quite have enough stone for that, so might have to make a quick, 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 quick trip over here. Just to get a tiny bit of stone and some leaves as well. Should only be a very quick trip though, because we need to get back in time for the monster wave. And yeah, hopefully the portal will last long enough. I have plenty of mana, so we should be good. But yeah, in the next episode, we will defeat the next monster wave and we will actually begin in the tech tree, if we take a look here. Advanced time working and then we can actually start making, um, portal, what is this again? Kidome portals to biomes and multiply games using Inspector Bell. Biomes? Does that mean we can go back to the first one? We will have to make that and see what happens. Um, but yeah, we can actually start doing some stuff here, which is actually going to be pretty exciting. Uh, make two of those, there we go, and equip them to this guy and this guy also we need some more armor as well if we can afford it make that and this we need some more rope can we make some rope yes we can make some rope and there we go and equip that to our new guy all right last thing i'm going to do is to take the dwarf here go rest uh you're fine go rest go rest oh i don't know why this has not been accepted. Oh, pause. Don't know why this haven't been accepted as a bid. Uh, unpause. Pause. Uh, inventory. If someone can quickly put down a totem in here, I think that would be good. Come on, come on. We have one minute to finish to wrap this up. <laughs> come on, buddy. So I just need to follow these stars to make sure that they would actually sleep in here. Just stop right there. Oh, there we go. It continues. Down and includes this. Perfect. Now, I can select Wolf. Go rest. Uh, go rest. Actually, go rest. Uh, go rest. Go rest. 
and go home. So I can close this portal and we are ready for next episode. We have less than a minute. I'm going to cut it here. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't yet and enable those notifications. We will face the first monster wave next time and we will progress in the technology tree and expand the base even more. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave a like if you did and share with your friends and family and all that good stuff. Links down below for my Twitch, Twitter and Discord server. And yeah, hope you enjoy it. And I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.